My name is Christian Rodney. I'm in Portsmouth. Uh, I uh, represent District 11 in the State Senate, uh, which now is redistricting includes uh, a substantial portion of activity. Uh, and I want to make a few a couple of quick points. And, and not, I, the point I'm going to make is exactly the rebuttal to that last judgment, so bear with me for just a few seconds. Of course, the, the, the personal impact I suppose have on myself, my medical offices are all over the state and will spare this bridge. My patients have to come back and forth across this bridge. My in-laws live in Terry and I live in Portsmouth. The effect upon lifestyle, business, economy, all these issues have been, have been done so many times and I do appreciate you and your staff for this thing. But let me make the same point I made last night in the meeting, uh, and I think it directly I address as what was said in the last week. I am deeply saddened by the idea, the philosophy of, and I didn't make up this term, it's called a la carte government. More and more we turn around and we say, well, I don't use that, so I shouldn't pay for it. And that leads to the destruction of what we create in our towns, our cities, our states, and our country. The person who pays to help support the schools but doesn't necessarily use the schools. The person who doesn't necessarily drive over the bridge, but helps to create the bridge because that bridge is an economic driver for the state, and it's an important part of our, our culture, our society, our industry. So saying that we use it so that we should pay for it leads us down a path where no one ever wants to share in a community. No longer, as you said, I feel like we're No longer are we together. Government. Government is going to become all about me. If I don't use it, why should I pay for it? When we start saying that, then we got big problems. Thank you for your time.